kids. They're bundles of energy, but they need the right snacks to keep them going. That's why I give my kids Freddy Bars. The fool. <laughs> why am I not surprised that you haven't done a video on net neutrality, PewDiePie? It's sad how much you're disconnected from regular people. PewDiePie, please make a video about net neutrality and spread awareness about it, please. PewDiePie, please, everybody's waiting on you from the community to help make a video about Stop FCC taking control of net neutrality. Do a video on net neutrality, please, we need you. I'm surprised the biggest guy on YouTube, a career on the internet, isn't just a little concerned with net neutrality. Unless it's missing something otherwise. It would really help if someone has access to more than 50 million subs to spread awareness to me. I don't know, maybe a video PSA at least, but you know, that's just a thought. Well, carry on everybody. Have a good day. Urgent! If you're not freaking out about net neutrality right now, you're not paying attention. Listen here, okay? I know what it's like to have bad internet, alright? Don't come to me being all like, oh, net neutrality, everything is gonna be bad, oh! Listen, everyone knows we want net neutrality. What do you want me to say about it? It's been all over the internet. It's literally been blasted. How do you not know about this? Uh, your favorite YouTuber has made a video about it. Everyone has talked about it. What do you want me to say about it? First of all, in case you for some reason don't know what net neutrality is, let's look it up. Net neutrality is the principle that internet service providers and governments regulating the internet must treat all data on the internet the same and not discriminate or charge differentially by user, content, website, platform, application, type of attachment. Okay, I don't care. I immediately don't care. Okay, but he isn't in the US. So unless the UK government is retarded, it doesn't affect him. Oh, it would seem this doesn't affect me. <laughs> Suck it, America. No, for real. Sorry. Okay, the memes got ahead of me. Of course it's a serious issue. Of course it is. Let's see what, what people are saying about net neutrality. Okay, here we go. Come on! Oh, come on. Ugh. Still loading? Still loading. Still loading. Have you ever been stuck on a really slow internet connection? One yes. so slow that you just can't stream video or you have to give up on using certain sites or apps because yeah. they just Yes, make yes, you how did you know this? Well, imagine that certain sites were permanently confined to a slow lane like that. Practically while they are others were allowed to operate at full speed. Oh my god. Unless you What the what the what the what I, I already have this problem. <laughs> you trying to sell me an issue that I already have? <laughs> no thank you. Okay? It would be like paying to board earlier for an airplane, but for just about anything that you do online. I love paying extra so I can get in earlier. It's great. I don't have to stand in line with all the weirdos. The idea that internet service providers shouldn't be allowed to discriminate against or grant preferential treatment to particular sites. Also, sorry, but Stripe, you can't wear Stripe on camera. Like, did no one tell you that? Without net neutrality, broadband providers like Comcast, Charter, as well as mobile carriers like AT&T and Verizon could slow Netflix to a crawl in order to keep you paying for their television package. Get that, excuse me, get that man out of my face. Basically, a world without net neutrality might mean that you have to pay more to access the internet content you want. But it could also crush innovation because without a level playing field, New apps and services won't be able to compete with entrenched companies. Like anyone gives a shit. Come on, let's get real here. People want net neutrality because they don't want the government to interfere with the internet. That, 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 not so fast. Pits from the past here made a big mistake here. My microphone stopped working. I'm sorry. It's late. But I feel like it's important because I don't want to spread misinformation on what's clearly already a very confusing topic. Uh, the FCC is a government agency and the government wanting to repeal net neutrality, my immediate thought was, oh, okay, so the government wants to take more control over the internet and that's why everyone is so outraged. When this is actually a rare case of the government saying, hey, we want less control here uh, and more into to the ISPs. Net neutrality is the government 
sort of controlling and making sure that ISPs are held to a certain standard, that they can't block access to certain websites and keeping the internet free and neutral. And I think that's very, very important. So I clearly got it wrong and uh, I wanted to apologize and set the record straight. The head of FCC, also villain of the internet, Ajit Pai, has come forward to explain. Hi, I'm Ajit Pai. I'm the chairman of the FCC. I really enjoy the public debate about the future of the internet. No, 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 no you fucking don't. <laughs> shut, shut the fuck up. You're already lying. Now, Ajit Pai has been Actually, on a media campaign Ajit to me twist the public's Except uh, of idea of... of net neutrality to sort of switch it around and it's not it's not going great for Ajit I always tell the truth basing on any video with him in and the dislike bar so the F so basically for those of you who don't know back in 2015 this whole discussion had already happened I don't know if you guys remember remember Coney 2012 well then it was net neutrality 2015 and here we are again net neutrality 2017 system is working Yet, Mr. Chairman, you're proposing to undo the open internet order. Uh, what is the problem, Mr. Chairman, that you are trying to fix? Yes, thank you. Finally, I want the answer of this. Thank you for the question, Senator. Uh, I think one of the concerns that uh, we have raised is that these regulations might be dampening infrastructure investment. They might be, but there's no evidence of it. Well, there has been evidence raised, and that's part of the reason why we are testing this proposition in the context of the notice of proposed rulemaking. Some had suggested the FCC should simply issue a declaratory ruling, saying that the facts in the law are so, and that's the way it's going to be. But we wanted to test this proposition in an open and public process. What, what, the, what, the, what, the, what, 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 what are you saying? At this rate, I, I'm convinced that Ajit just wants to remove net neutrality so he can delete all the mean comments about him on the internet. <laughs> uh, he's been on Fox News where they try to twist repealing net neutrality as a left and right issue. Oh, uh, the, the mainstream media, uh, maybe we should just call, call them what they are, the leftist media there, the Washington Post anyway, writes this today, sir. So they're basically trying to angle it like, oh, it's the left media, the, ah, those stupid leftists. When really, according to uh, polling, everyone is against net neutrality. It's not a political left and right sort of question. A lot of celebrities have been tweeting about the FCC share tweeted, net neutrality means Trump can change the internet. It will include less Americans, not more. I, I don't know, I can't read this. This is so incoherent, but uh, Pai replied to this saying, another concern I've heard is that the plan will harm rural and low income Americans. Tier, for example, has tweeted that the internet will include less Americans, not more, if my proposal is adopted. But the opposite is true. The digital divide is all too real. Too many rural and low income Americans are still unable to get high speed internet so basically a big argument for uh, to repeal net neutrality is so that more people uh, the government can build out for more people to get access to the internet so really he's just looking after all of this why can't the government do that without repealing net neutrality i have no idea why is it if that's what he wants why does the fcc want mobile data to count as broadband internet that idea which is an idea that would further cut off poor and rural areas from decent internet you you kind of get it you're saying one thing but you're showing the other uh the fcc also made a myth versus fact to sort of clear out what the facts are saying that this is the end of the internet as we know it they're saying no that's not true stardust will not be able to compete with title II regulations they're saying no that's not true inner service providers will block you from visiting the website you want to visit they're saying no that's not true and basically anything that people are saying about the um about net neutrality or they're saying that's incorrect Actually, that's not how it's gonna work, but it doesn't say how or why or when and really I haven't seen any convincing argument for should we ruin something that is already clearly working fine It's just oh more people will have access to the internet. Sure, buddy. Sure Since I'm re-recording this bit I might as well add that since you guys told me the reason why I just thinks that this will bring out more uh, infrastructure to rural areas is because there will be more competition with the government interfering less. This is all speculation, but I also think it's 
worth mentioning that Ajit used to work for one of the biggest internet service providers in USA, Verizon, and it sort of make you question, like, what's the motive here? Is he just helping out his buddies from his old company? It doesn't really make sense, and I'm sure the way net neutrality is presented by a lot of uh, media campaigns and that it's so bad, I'm sure it's not as bad as people are saying. But I'm, but I've also haven't seen any argument for why it's a good idea to repeal net neutrality. The whole thing is just absurd. No one believes Ajit Pai. And like I said, I, I, I'm convinced this is just his personal vendetta with the internet at this, at this point. But the, as always, the memes is a very tasty from this. <laughs> Sounds familiar, doesn't it? Yup, I'm talking about this. Net neutrality. We need to speak up. Just like everyone else says, if we don't speak up, bye bye fandoms, bye bye memes, bye bye fan art, bye bye fanfics. God damn it. Why net neutrality is important? Just imagine EA is your internet provider. <laughs> yeah, no. My internet is so good. Support net neutrality. The internet should be free. If you want to build out rural areas, I'm sure you can do it without fucking with the internet, okay? Just leave, leave our memes alone. Thank you.